Now you saw what a standing wave looks like. Now we're going to see what a standing wave sounds like. Because what you got here is you got your basic hoot tube. It's called a hoot tube because it's a tube and it hoots. See? That's why it's called a hoot tube. Down at the bottom here, I have some wire mesh. And when he gets the fire going here, like that, I'm going to heat up that wire mesh at the bottom, like this. And when it gets good and red hot down there, we are going to take it off the fire. Watch what happens. There it is. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Now, you probably have got to ask yourself, why does it do that? And I got to ask you, supposing I held you over that flame, I'll bet you'd make some noise too. <laughs> yes, no, that's not what's happening. I'm being silly now. Actually, what happens is that we have a wire mesh down there which heats up the air. The air that is heated gets less dense. It's pushed up through the tube, and it's pushed through the wire mesh, and we end up with a hissing sound down there. Very light, very small, but a hissing sound, and it's composed of all kinds of different frequencies. This tube, because of how long it is, picks up one of those frequencies and sets up a standing wave with nodes and anti-nodes inside the tube. Now let's just do it again, and I'll show you how the air moving through it is what we need to have happen. So I'll heat up that wire mesh down there again until it gets nice and red hot. And then I will take it off. And if I tip it on its side, of course, there's no air flowing up through there anymore because it can't move upward. But if I were to take this and I were to put it like this, and then, <laughs> cool, huh? This is physics, man. This is physics. Yeah, just as long as you have the air going through it, you will hear that sound because of its length. Now, Jack. Yeah. I see that I have a tube that is a different length. Shh. Okay. Than you have. Uh huh. Um, does that mean we're going to get a different sound? That means the very same thing. Yes, Claire, you old smarty person. Yes, that is correct. <laughs> All right, but mine doesn't have any mesh in it. All that's in there is my beautiful face. Yes, can I can see that? see that. How about the other way? If you go the other way, what's... Oh. Is it... Or is that the same? It's the same old face. Okay. <laughs> that's because there's <laughs> nothing in this one. But we do have a wire mesh on top of our burner here. So there's a little hissing sound right down there. We'll hold this over there like that. Pretty oh, cool, huh? Oh, that's different cool. sound because it's a different length. But it's still... Oh, now we're talking hoot tube. Let's see, well, Claire. Well, you know, if we Let's can go see. with a different sound from a different length, uh -huh. I'm interested to see what kind of sound we get out of this Let's see what kind of sound, we get, sound we get out of this baby. All right, here we go. Here we go, over the top. <clears throat> Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, oh. Sounds like something out of the jungle. Yeah, it's a jungle sound. Oh, there's... Oh, kind of the makes you want to go... Wee hee 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 In the jungle, the quiet jungle, the lion sleeps tonight. Hoo, hoo, ha! There we go, standing waves inside of hoot tubes, and there you go.